Shimming best practices. Safety. Always handle shims by the safety tab. Try to position the safety tab so it doesn't protrude over the base plate. Never let your fingers get under the machine feet when it's lifted. Cleaning. Brush and clean under the machine feet to remove grime, rust, and paint. Clean dirty shims prior to reinserting them under the foot. Material. Use stainless steel, pre-cut slotted shims, or incompressible, chemical-resistant, high-heat plastic shim stock. Do not reuse corroded, bent, or otherwise damaged shims. If you're cutting shims from shim stock, make sure all edges are deburred. Sizing. Choose the correct shim size based on load zone around the anchor bolt, horsepower of the machine, bolt slot size. Thickness. Use a micrometer to confirm the thickness of any shims 0.05 inch or greater. Determine the existing shim pack thickness with a micrometer. Shim pack. Consolidate to no more than four pre-cut shims under each foot. Sandwich thinner shims between thicker ones to protect them. Adjustments. Insert shims until they touch the bolt. Then, retract them slightly to prevent damage to the shim. After inserting the shim pack, tighten the anchor bolts to the correct torque. Step shimming, angled or bent foot. Additional shims are placed in stepped offsets above the main shim pack. Do not use more than four shims to create the step shim wedge. Use only when absolutely necessary. Safety note, trim the excess portion of the step shims that protrude.